Hello. Y'all, I washed this head last night. And I haven't styled her yet. So, don't come for me. Those that got locks is natural. It was one of them. I just put some oil in it and let, put my bonnet on and let her do what she do. Then I took a nap. And now we've got it. But, how y'all doing? It's tough for a spiritualist. Real life spiritual motivator, Miss King. Thank y'all for tuning in with me. So, I want to tap into these energies. Okay? Now, again... Keep us in mind, because I've, I've seen some people comment, well, this didn't happen. This ain't my situation. Okay, don't try to make something fit where it doesn't. This is a general reading for whoever who may come upon this. It may resonate with you. It may not. Okay? But take, in general, what the message is. If you're not single, take the part about love out. Right? If you've got issues with family, with friends, with coworkers, with whatever, uh, what, take that for whatever this is. Okay? But in general... I have here that someone doesn't like how blessed you are. Someone doesn't like the stability you have. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, energy, this knight of coin. is taking you a long time to get to this stability that you have in your life. This value, okay? This security. The knight of coins, the slowest moving deck, the slowest moving card, and the tarot deck. But you can bank on the stability that this coin that he holding that he brings four of cups people are wondering why aren't people offering them the same cups that's coming towards you it's kind of like why you oh why are they so salty now again this is i would definitely say you know who this is to you you know who this is to you you know who this is to you i don't know who this is to you this could be love, this could be family, this could be a uh, co-worker, this could be brother, sister, this could be uh, mother, father, aunt, uncle, uh, auntie, uncle. Uh, you know who the players are in your life. Six of Cups. You have received an offer or have extended an offer emotionally to someone or something from your past, the world, and it's giving you a whole new beginning, a whole new life. This is seen, you're seen as... Again, having a new life. Why is this energy here today? Who is this? Oh, okay. A domineering energy. This is someone who wanted to control you and cut you out. King of Swords. This is someone who wanted you to feel less than. R money is the root of uh, evil. Greed is the root of unhappiness. There is something with money that, that happened, okay? Greed. You were cut out because of money or some type of abundance. They wanted you to feel confused, isolated, alone, unwanted, not a part of anything. But it looks like whatever's going on, they're now going through this exact feeling of feeling alone, unsupported, no one reaching out to them, no new beginnings. But they got what they wanted. They wanted you out. They wanted you to know this. They wanted you to feel this. And maybe you felt it for a time. Okay? The king of swords is the king of, of the sword. They will cut you out. Be real harsh with it. Real cold with it. Okay? And again, it has to do with money. Nine of coin. Because ten of coin is utmost ability. This could do with an inheritance. But you've received some sort of inheritance after this, okay? Someone offered you something that was a lot more emotionally fulfilling. And now it's like, again, you have a whole new world, beloved. Let me see what else is going on with you. Just so you need to be aware. So, because again, I feel that it's been quite some time. Whoever these energies are, they were hoping that you would you would reach out. Yeah, you got a feminine energy. You could also have a masculine energy. We didn't have uh, Five of Swords energy here. This is someone who creates conflict. This person, they're always negative. They're the negative Nancy. They will try to say, mind you, you they cut you out, so you stayed away. But this person, these energies, they are still in this five of swords energy. It's always something going on. Again, it's like they have their nose up at you, right? Why? Because you're love, the star. You could be an Aquarius. You have wish fulfillment. You found your balance in this life. Again, the queen of swords. The king and queen of swords, you could have had, again, several people do this to you, masculine and feminine. I feel these are people that were close to you that, were, that thought, queen of swords, that thought you would feel this cut to where you would feel alone. But look, I would look at you. 
Look at it, four, four fire, 11, 11, synchronistic, happy. You didn't got blessed over this. Queen of coins, stability, your home now, queen of coin. It took you a long time to get to this, this stability, but now you're, you're, you're home, you're stable, you're happy, you're abundant, and you're a queen. People receive who you are now, chosen. It's been a pleasure to bring you this reading. Knight of Cups, see? You came in, you expressed an offer of love somewhere, and you were received with the Two of Cups. You're home. You have new beginnings, new love, new stability, new foundation, but most importantly, new love. This is not romantic. And this, this happened fast with the Ace of Fire, but it's because you're the Empress. You're royalty. And people see this. You may not have even seen you, how people see you, how people know of you, but there's something special about you, beloved. And now it looks like you've got family or uh, some, some sort that's been waiting to receive you and it's taken a long time with this knight of coin you may not have realized or known where you were going but you knew there was something of value for you and you went from the knight to the empress the emperor okay hold on hold on fam let me get let, let, let me get your cloak okay so it's been a pleasure to bring you this reading y'all y'all have a blessed day if you need me journey with spirit 222 at gmail.com is how you can reach me for one-on-ones if you want to send some donations some love you can hit the cash app journey with spirit 222 all right but until next time y'all be well and be blessed bye